Make sure you like. Like. Make comment, sure you share. share and hit that what? All right. So make sure you do all those things. You want to say anything else? Hello, my vibrations and my co-creators. It's V to the I to the B to the mother of four E. And here I am with day three. <laughs> No, it's day four. Yeah, because 10, 11, 12, 13. Day four of my 100-day reality challenge. And today, excuse me, I chose to focus on self-awareness. Those were my two words for today. Of course, yourself. You always must be aware of everything that comes out of your mouth, how you feel, and that was a big part of today was becoming aware of how I was feeling. And I noticed that um, nowadays, my I'm short-tempered. Nowadays, the littlest thing can upset me. And I never used to be like that. The things that upset me now are more or less the people not saying excuse me people not saying thank you the little the little things that make us human and make us be able to just have unconditional love for everyone i mean it doesn't hurt to say thank you or please or hold the door for somebody or use your blinker when you need to get over into a lane or uh any anything basically that we can be doing to help one another out so today like normal, well, not like normal. Let me stop saying like normal. Today for my routine practices, I did get up and I did take my uh, 15. Today was about 15 minutes and 15 seconds. I did a Deepak uh, Chopra, Chopra and Oprah um, meditation. And today's meditation, the focus was today I focus on what I want to attract in my life. And I wrote a couple things that I wanted to attract. And those things are like my focus, like to stay positive because our thoughts attract things. Our energy attract things. If you keep thinking about the things that you don't want, those are the things that you're going to get. So I've been trying to think about the things that I do want, the feelings that I do want to feel, the relationships that I do want to have. And I noticed that um, today for self-awareness that I have not been the best at staying, at communicating with someone, at, at uh, staying in touch. That's what I wrote down. Working on being better with staying in touch, communicating my feelings and thoughts. Because I was, I, a lot has happened to make me excuse me, not be as vocal as I was. And I'm working on pushing past those things so that I'm able to journal freely like I used to. And that's that's really good because I've been able to. I've been able to. And I have so many thoughts that go through in my mind that it's, it's, it's crazy. And yes, it's still there. So, you know. Oh, yes, it is what it is. It tells me how I'm doing and that too. But you see that? That'll be gone in a couple of days. If you leave it alone, well, my skin, if I leave it alone and just put some cocoa butter on it, it'll usually go away. But yeah, back to it. Um, I went back and I watched my day three of my 100 day reality challenge. Well, day four, I watched it. And it was um, a year later since my mom had passed. It was March the 19th, 2008. And I said in that video, because I was really, 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 really journaling back then. Feelings are strong enough to drain all your energy through your emotions. So that's that's something that I'm like, yes, 
Yes, I I remember feeling that way. And it's it's crazy that I'm still feeling that way. And it's like, okay, me saying that to myself and being able to watch myself say that is like, yes, feelings are strong enough to drain all your energy through your emotions. So it's like, you have to... We have to really, 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 really pay attention to how we are feeling so that we don't respond just to give a reaction that we actually are are digesting what we're thinking about so that it comes out in a clear message and self-awareness. And I saw something today and I think it was on, I forget where I saw it. It said, real self-awareness is realizing you are not for everybody. And I am realizing that because, you know, me being a Leo, I, I gravitate to anything that has positive energy. And sometimes I haven't been welcomed. And sometimes people think I'm loud. Sometimes people... So you just got to realize that you are not for everyone. So as we go into day, what, five tomorrow, um, I plan on giving you guys a new video. Other, other than my 100-day uh, reality challenge. And also, I got some new frogs. So you might see those in the the video that I have out tomorrow but we're six minutes in so that is day four self-awareness was today's words and um this is really really a big process so day four into it I'm still grasping my routine that I want to have and um still haven't had a full week of work yet which will be next week will be my full monday tuesday wednesday thursday and friday work week i had one work day off even though it is just teaching one cycle class a day that is something that big that i i believe you know is something that you should get in your physical activity every day because i've noticed since i've been able to get that physical activity in in the morning it makes my day go so much different. So whether you get in 10 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes, 40 minutes, something. Start out with yoga. Start out with stretches. But let's do this. Ugh. Okay. It's going on eight minutes. See y'all tomorrow.